Good evening, YouTubers. Mm, excuse me, sorry. Just had my dinner. Um, got back from the job. Of course, I did get it, which we all knew was going to happen. Um, the unfortunate thing is, I don't get paid for it until I've done 20 hours of something called Oz Swim. I need to become a proper swimming instructor before they're going to pay me. So, 18 hours more to go with unpaid work. But hey, the way I see that is as this. It is better to be getting out of the house and doing something for two hours a day rather than sitting around here doing nothing. And uh, the fact of the matter is I can do it um, up at um, North Sydney Pool, which is just uh, a unicycle away. So, uh, you know, it all, but uh, hey, look, let me tell you guys quickly about the job. It was, it was so sweet, right? You know, I had, I had kids aged um, about four or five years to, um, I guess, 11 years. Which I don't know why they put me with them. Like fuck, I was like, why don't you put me with, like with the three or four year olds? I can't, I can't teach kids how to swim. And they're like, all right, we got to do bilateral swimming and fucking duck dives and you know, one, two, three, breathe this way and one, two, three, breathe that way. And I was like, fuck, you know, I'm in over my head. I can't even do that shit. But you know, you know, we had the sweetest little kids. You know, these little six year olds. They're so happy with themselves when they do this lap. And you know, you give them all this encouragement. You say, oh man, that was great. You know, you really listen, like, because I had this, uh, a proper swimming instructor with me um, called Joe, and she's, she was really cool. She was really, really helpful and also gave a lot of encouragement, you know, to them, you know, and, um, you know, she's a mum, so, you know, she knows how to deal with kids, but, you know, it's just great, you know, you get to the end and this little six-year-old looks up at you and goes, oh, I did this and I did that, and you're like, you know, fully congratulating them, you go, yeah, that was brilliant, buddy, and, you know, and, you know, you give him little high fives and stuff for doing what they, you know. It was great. It was fantastic. So, um, you know, I mean, you know, I was kind of disappointed that she hadn't told me I wasn't going to be getting paid for doing what I did today and until, you know, I got out of the pool. I was dressed and about to go home and I said, so, okay, so I don't get paid for this, do I? And she's like, oh, well, you know, you need to kind of be a proper swimming instructor. I was like, okay, fair enough. What the swimming instructors are, I'll have to look that up on the website. Um, so yeah, I mean, but look, let's face it guys, what is better, going out and helping uh, swimming instructors teach little kids how to swim and, you know, being part of that, you know, uh, you know that learning process and, and all those, you know, it, you, you have no idea how proud these kids are of themselves. It's so great to see, so positive and stuff and, you know, you barely need to do anything. You just, you know, swim around next to them, give them a bit of encouragement, like push their legs up if they're, you know, stinking or you know, give them a few little hints and tips, which, you know, not that I know what I'm talking about, but, you know, it's fairly obvious when you see a kid going wrong. Um, so, yeah, it was it was a great, great couple of hours. Um, I think two and a half hours I was there and, um, you know, thank God it was heated. It was bloody cold, though, walking out of this nice, humid, hot, like, heated pool, humid room, then fucking having to go into the change room outdoors in the coldest winter in 30 years. Oh, oh. Man, it wasn't pleasant. Then I had to unicycle up to the station again, and it was dark, which it still is. So, um, but hey, look, it was a brilliant experience for me because, you know, I need to get back into work slowly. It's the first time I worked in 12 months, believe it or not. So, you know, things are on the up and up. Got a new job. Just need to complete about 20 hours of training before I get paid. But, you know, it's cool. This Oz Swim thing, I get it's recognized around the world, so I could, you know, go to Canada or England and teach swimming. I don't know if that's what I want to do. I mean, I want to do my teacher's aid stuff, but, uh, you know, just um, got to answer a few questions about why I went to court so many times over the last five years. They, they wrote me a please explain as to why did I go to court five different times for these different things. But they're all minor. I mean, if the Deputy Director of Education, like the Department of Education, the Deputy... No, 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 no. The, the, the Director General, the guy, the head honcho of the um, New South Wales Department of Education is an ex-heroin dealer and addict who had spent time in jail for heroin distribution. And so if, you know, the head honcho from the Department of Education can get away with dealing heroin, I'm sure I can get away with stealing a few Band-Aids from a fucking medical center when I was off my face and riding around on a motorbike and motor scooter unregistered and unlicensed and having a bit of weed in my possession. Which are the only things I've been to court for, really, apart from 
a few other various things that don't come up as criminal records. These are convictions we're talking about. So, you know. Um, but anyway, hey, look, that's, that's going back into the negative land, isn't it? Look, hey, it was a great day and I'm back and I, I might even give you a lip sync tonight. Who knows, you know? So why don't, why, don't, why don't you guys start giving me some suggestions? I had a great one, uh, you know that song? Once I was afraid, I was petrified. Na 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 by my side. You know that song? I might learn the lyrics tonight and do it. I'll just read them off the screen if I can't come up with them. Anyway, look, try it, Mum. Crapping on now. So look, I just wanted to say good day and uh, word to your mothers. Hope you're doing well. Word.